Hello everyone. In this video, I want to show you one of the herbs used a lot in Vietnamese cuisine. Vietnamese perilla, also known as rau tieto in Vietnamese, is a popular herb in Vietnamese cuisine. It belongs to a min family, Lan Mia Sia, and its scientific name is perilla flu tessons. Here are some key points about this herb. Appearance. Vietnamese perilla has broad, slightly serrated leaves that are green on the top and purplish red on the underside. The leaves are often overshaped and have distinctive aroma. Second, culinary uses. It is commonly used in Vietnamese dishes for its unique flavor, which is a combination of basil, mint, and anise. The leaves are often used in fresh salads, soups, and as garnish. Popular dishes are fixture perilla include Vietnamese summer rolls gọi cung and the herbal dipping sauce mắm nem. Third, nutritional value. Perilla leaves are rich in vitamins A and C, calcium, iron, and dietary fiber. They also contain essential oils that are believed to have antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. Fourth, Medicinal uses. In traditional Vietnamese medicine, perilla is used to treat various ailments such as colds, flu, headaches, and digestive issues. The herb is believed to have properties that can help in reducing symptoms of asthma and allergies. Fifth, cultivation. Vietnamese perilla grows well in temperate and prefers well-trained soil. It is usually grown from seeds and can be cultivated in both garden beds and pots. Sixth, cultural significance beyond its culinary and medicinal uses perilla also holds cultural importance in vietnam it is often included in meals as a symbol of freshness and health overall vietnamese perilla is versatile and valuable herbs in Vietnamese culture contributing both to the flavor of dishes and to traditional health practices. Perilla fruit essence is an edible herb native to many countries in Asia. Its leaves and oil are used in cooking as medicine. Perilla leaf, seed, and stem are used as three different Chinese medicines. It contains chemicals that might decrease swelling and help reduce the growth of cancer cells. Perilla seed oil is also high in fatty acid, alpha-linolenic acid. People use perilla for hay fever, asthma, canker sores, dementia, and many other conditions. But there is no good scientific evidence to support these uses. Don't confuse perilla with other plants with similar common names, including alpha-linolenic acid, culos, Salvia divinorum, English horse mint, Japanese mint, peppermint, 
spare mint and white mint. These are not the same. Thank you so much and I hope that I give you some insight about these purple herbs and if you can plant some in your yard, you can enjoy benefits. And also you can use on one of my favorite dish is bánh xèo. Thank you so much. Until next time, have a wonderful day.